Hello again, my friends. Today I have a very exciting piece, this Tweety and Sylvester piece. This is actually the biggest piece I have done to date. So I used my old aluminum ladder that my father gave me. And I basically was like, you know what? I'm gonna go for it. I wanna do something huge and big and make it stand out. So here it is. So I'm not gonna lie, I was pretty intimidated going into doing this piece, but you know what, like I always say, you just gotta believe in yourself. You gotta believe in your talents and your abilities because when you put your mind to it, you really can't achieve anything. So here I'm just filling in more of the colors. I really was loving this orange by Luke Colors. This definitely had to be one of my favorite parts. I love to do Tweety Bird's eyes because I don't think that they look good with the outline on them. So just straight up like navy blue and then the lighter blue and you're good to go. piece this big so it's pretty dope I'm not gonna lie I wanted to keep part of this piece showing to the cyberpunk guy he was actually at where I did my secret writer piece too so I would hope okay so you're probably wondering if you like the cyberpunk guy so much why'd you go over his piece well I'll tell you that it took everything in me to not go over it but I had finished touching up the bendy and the pink panther and I went around the corner to go find a better spot to do this big piece on and this weird guy was lurking just looking at me so I was like yeah you know safety first let me just go hide in my little corner and do this so that's kind of how that ended up coming about but now I'm just doing the outlines here I started out with the New York fat and then I go over to sharpen them up with the banana
so it's actually the next day and I came back with the rollers so that I could get up higher and finish the rest of the hat because it just looked funny without the hat completed or at least more of it added on so I ended up doing that light purple and then the darker purple and then I used the black rust-oleum enamel gloss to outline it and do the ear and it actually turned out pretty good Well, here it is, you guys, my completed piece, this kind of fall Thanksgiving Halloween themed Tweety and Sylvester. This is my biggest piece yet, so it honestly is my favorite.